Same marker, Deadpool and Wolverine trailer. Let's get right to it. What's going on, Alamo City Movie Talk fans? As always, I'm your host, Ryan D. Well, Ryan Sixteen. This is Alamo City Movie Talk, guys. Thank you so much for making us a part of your day. You know what to do, guys. Like, share, subscribe to us, and let us know on the put on comments down below. We love talking to every single one of you guys. Let us know what y'all think of this trailer. We got it with the biggest trailer here. Ryan Reynolds posted actually the night uh, last night saying, "Hey, there's a little trailer tomorrow," and uh, he gave a little teaser. That teaser went viral. Now we got the official trailer. It's finally here. Deadpool and Wolverine. You excited for this? I am. I know we've seen a couple like teasers in uh, in theaters, so I'm really yeah. excited to see for Finally. the third Deadpool movie. Yeah, uh, I'm really the curious reveal. where this is gonna go. Yeah. So I mean, I love the first two movies. Obviously, like nothing beats the first one. It's great. Um, yeah. But I am curious to see how uh, Ryan Reynolds continues his character. Yeah. And I really, really am looking forward to Wolverine being part of this too. Oh yeah, Hugh, Absolutely. Hugh Jackman. I mean the the redemption stories back. I mean the whole concept of like, I don't think anyone would have called that Hugh Jackman come back and play it on the suit on the yellow the classic car the classic comic book. I was a cartoon, that's a comic book look cartoon. from, yeah, because <laughs> the X-Men, I mean, come on, the X-Men mean, cartoon, animated? yeah, I yeah. know, animate, oh, I'm sorry, animated, uh, but back then in the 90s, it was, yeah, it was a cartoon, but regardless, though, I'm going to say this, is that I'm, I'm excited for this, the reveal's finally here, we've been seeing a lot of teasers, we even saw the whole hair look, I love that, he's got it back again, I'm excited to see him just play this character all over mm. again, Hugh Jackman, Hugh. I want to see what other familiar faces we see, so that's going to yep. be great, let's get right fantastic. to it. Hope y'all ready for this, guys. Let's talk movies. Let's go. I told you, you're not welcome here. You're not welcome anywhere. Here. Now get the fuck out of my bar. Just give me one more drink and then I'll leave. Hi, Peanut. I'm gonna need you to come with me right now. Look, lady, I'm not interested. <laughs> All right, well, I'm sort of on the tick tick, so upsy daisy. Here we go. Oh, whiskey dick of the claws. It's quite common in Wolverines over 40. You don't want this. <laughs> Unless you want to take a deep breath through your fucking forehead, I suggest you reconsider. <laughs> That's cute, the two over colors. 40. Oh, wow. That looks really cool. Love I'm about suit. to lose everything that I've ever cared about. Mm-hmm. Not my fucking problem. <laughs> Is that what you said when your world went to shit? Come again. This Wolverine let down his entire world. Hmm. <laughs> Want to talk about what's haunting you, or should we wait for a third act flashback? Uh, go fuck <laughs> yourself. <laughs> oh, so soon. Life is a mystery. I don't know anything about saving worlds. Dang, he's acting so good. But you do. Trust me, kid, I'm no hero. Yeah. You were an X-Man. You were the X-Man. Mm-hmm. I am soaking wet right now. <laughs> oh, man, the car. I love it. Boys are so silly. Hmm. This is what I'm talking about. Big slow motion action sequence. (laughs) Who knows if you live or die? Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Oh, look at that. Wanna do some cocaine? Hey. One thing that Feige said is off limits. What about Bolivian marching powder? They know all the slang terms. They have a list. Even snowboarding? Even disco dust. White girl interrupter? Even force bump. <laughs> Do you want to build a snowman? Yes! I can't! <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. What'd you think of this trailer, Angela? <laughs> uh, it's exactly how I would imagine it to be. I mean, it's Deadpool. What, what else can you do? Yeah. Right? Um, I absolutely love the trailer. I think it was so funny. <laughs> And it's funny because he, he still breaks his like, fourth wall or whatever you call it, uh, where he yeah. just like breaks the whole co- complete narration. That's just in character with Deadpool. I loved it. It looks like it's going to be so much fun. 
Um, I really want to see how that world's Wolverine is. Mm -hmm. Um, He's just, I, I love Hugh Jackman. He's so great. I love him. Anything he does, <laughs> yeah. my favorite's Greatest Showman. He can never, oh, yeah. he can never oh, beat yeah. that. I, yeah. I know he's in so many other things, but that's just great. And I love that he's back. He's still got it. He still looks pretty good. Um, and I think this is going to be an absolute hilarious, fun movie. I, I think it's going to be really great. And I love the chemistry between them, too. <laughs> it's so <laughs> funny. And it's just, I cannot wait for this. It, July cannot come soon enough. It's almost here already. You know, we're almost in May. Yeah, I it's know. It's just a hop, skip, jump away from May. And yeah. it's, this, this trailer looks really good. What, what, what are your thoughts on this? So one of the things I'm going to say, um, Hugh Jackman, seeing him back, you know, in this role and everything, it's it's a very, I was shocked just like everyone else was when they first got announced and everything. Um, yeah, because he was supposed to be done with it, right? Yeah, like, and, and it's just, it's so awesome. He's back, uh, you know, as, in the words of Deadpool, you know, I'm Marvel's Jesus. Um, it, there's, there's something that's very cool about this trailer is that I really enjoyed it. I just feel like uh, in the beginning, I just felt like there was too many f bombs in the beginning. Kind of like, okay, we get it. It's a rated R m movie in a way. I mean, we get it. They're all rated yeah, R. Yeah, right? it's all rated. Oh yeah, yeah. And so um, th that's just my take. But typically, in typical Marvel trailers, guys, typically, if you you can go back, you can quote me on this. You can fact check me. Typically, in the you know Marvel trailers, they fr literally show like the first like thirty minutes to forty five minutes of the movie in the in the trailer for the most part. For most trailers, sure. it's it's most of it. Um, but besides all that, right? I this trailer is great. I enjoyed it. Um, there's still something very very uh, interesting here, and we got to know is uh, that is the villain in here. It kind of doesn't answer a lot of questions. It's cool to see Wolverine and Logan. But at the same time, though, what's happening? Like, we get it. They're trying to figure out, like, a multiverse in a way. But yeah. I feel like I wish we would have got, I mean, not a lot, right? But I kind of feel like they're keeping everything under wraps, which is okay. But at the same time, though, I kind of feel like that you could have gave us a little bit of a, like, maybe it's leaning towards this storyline or this because it's kind of uh, like you kind of don't know no, where you're going. I, I don't. I, I disagree with you yeah. because I feel like once you start getting into this is a story. Yeah. It gives well, it is a mind. story. It, it, yeah. Well, no, I'm saying like obviously they have to have a story, but when you get into a trailer of like this is the story, yeah, uh, especially for like a high, uh, highly mm. anticipated big budget film like this, yeah, um, I think a lot of trailers for kind of movies like that tend to over explain and overshare, mm -hmm. and I don't like that because okay. if when it does that, it's like I've already seen the movie. In the when I'm actually watching the movie, I'm like, oh yeah, I, I already know what's gonna happen in the scene mm -hmm. because it showed in the trailer. So I appreciate that we got good bits of it, like we obviously see them together. Mm -hmm. But I like that they didn't share too much. It's just enough to get you intrigued. You know, it's gonna be the same magic, the same humor. Yeah. You know, they all, both have chemistry. You do get a sense of like, like you say, mm -hmm. questions of like, what what's yeah. happening in this world? You know, is it a yeah. multiverse? What's going on? Well, this seems to be like a battle world of like different multiverses right. colliding together. One of the things I do want to say, and we did confirm it in this trailer, was that the the official villain is Cassandra Nova from the comics, X Men comics, and everything. Mm -hmm. And here's I don't the, know, the, the, the comics. <laughs> yeah. I don't the comics. Here, here's here's the thing. So it's. Definitely a multiverse movie in a way. I mean, it obviously doesn't have multiverse in the title, but it, it's still about a multiverse where uh, it's colliding. And that's the thing too. Which Wolverine is this? Because you kind of don't... Is it after Logan? Is it after X-Men 3? It's, yeah, it's a lot it. I, of questions. I love that yeah. we don't get that answer in the trailer. Well, we kind of do in a way. I don't know. I just feel like this is Logan's. I feel like this is after Logan. Yeah, but you can, you can, yeah. you can speculate all you want. Yeah. But again, I like the trailer left those questions yeah. unanswered because yeah. that way you see the movie and you yeah. figure out what's going on. Yeah. I don't need that answer in yeah. the trailer. Yeah. I need the answer in the movie. Okay. So I really appreciate that it didn't like, yeah. I know it would have, sure, it would have been great to know what story yeah. it was. Sure. Yeah. But I think all really fans want to see in this is Deadpool being Deadpool yeah. and Wolverine being Wolverine. Well, this is the introduction to Deadpool to the, the Avengers now. Mm -hmm. Like cuz we see that, we saw that in, in the in the teaser and we saw how he's looking at all the different Avengers, all the different screens mm -hmm. and everything. So it's kind of I'm kind of figuring out which multiverse if this is a multi is Deadpool, if Deadpool is it, a multiverse, it which be. I kind of think it they are. Be, yeah, yeah, they're leaning on its own like Oh, this is I'm in the multiverse where Disney is rated R or some some shitty some joke like that. I feel like that would make sense, and he'll joke about well, that. Yeah, because we saw yeah. the the portal. Yeah, yeah. So, but a lot though, a lot. Uh, uh, I mean, it could be a portal, not to necessary to another multiverse. It could be a portal to like just 
safe haven or anything like that so i feel like that there's know. a lot of questions in here more so than answers um Which but is yeah great. that's all i need all yeah. i need but again i i really like the trailer right? oh yeah you, you, you yes. get a sense it's rated r it's, yeah it's same humor it's it's gonna have magic you know mm-hmm. again i i'm not a hugest fan of ryan reynolds but he is funny i will mm-hmm. say he was made for this role mm-hmm. uh and i am a huge fan of hugh jackman and i'm glad to see him back i think he looks great he's gonna yes. be great both of them are gonna be awesome yep so i cannot wait to see this movie come july i know i can't wait to see i'm guessing it's gonna be a uh, multiverse uh, collapsing with one another i'm excited for that i'm like ex- um dude this tr- this is literally the only marvel movie that's coming out and it looks spectacular it looks fantastic uh, Disney better Hugh not jackman no i don't no, think so papa Iger is back in the house <laughs> he is cleaning house and he is making great quality content over quantity i'll leave it at that guys but yeah i'm really excited for this cannot wait to see more i I, i'm very interested to see the toy line for this as well because the toy line is gonna be really good i'm definitely interested in getting a huge because hugh jackman i mean playing x-men the x-men movies was the first ever team up build in cinema history yeah, where like yeah w- yeah like x-men was the number one com- for comic book movies at the time where like there wasn't a N- natasha's there wasn't nostalgia for the comic book movies at the time because for a team up like that of that caliber and i really did appreciate when it came out it was of course um uh, before that of course was the punisher i believe that came out too as well mm, blade i think blade was the first one first blade that came out but was the first marvel movie in a way but the first marvel team up wasn't the avengers it was x-men and I'll leave it at that, guys. Mm-hmm. But I, was, I mean, you did yeah. forget uh, Daredevil too. Oh well, yeah, but it but wasn't the team. Daredevil. But hey, I, I mean, st- hey, hey, was hey, in hey, there. hey, 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 whoa, whoa, yeah, hey, calm down there. Don't we start talking? <laughs> sh- uh, don't talk. Hey, Ben Affleck is Daredevil. Still, I still like it. I still appreciate it. <laughs> to you. All right, all <laughs> right, guys. All right, before we get into it, question is for you guys. What did y'all think? Put a comment down below. Did you enjoy this trailer? Are you excited for this? Are you excited for all the comments that's coming out of here? Put a comment down below. Let us know your thoughts down below. As always, I'm your host, Ryan D. I'm Angela. This is Alamo Steam Talk, guys. See you at the movies. Catch you later on the fly. Latest.